Good morning, Kaufman. Today is Monday, April 10th, 2017. My name's Nick. And I'm John, and you're watching Kaufman Live. Got a secret, can you keep it? Swear this one you save. Better lock it in your pocket, taking this one to the grave. In the show, you let them know you won't tell what I said. Cause two can keep a secret if one of them is dead. Nick, um, it's a special week for music. Yes, actually. it is. One of the best directors of our time, I'd go ahead and say. Really? Yes. You're going to... I know, who really am I? But over Spielberg. Uh, well, I said one Scorsese. of, not the best. I All said right. one of. No, no, do your thing. But it's it's Tarantino Music Week. Yes, it is. I, uh, I really wanted to do like a Rat Pack Week and really uh, civilize you guys and uh, try to bring some he's more calling, refinement to this school. He's calling you like but it's fine. low level. It's fine. That's an insult. Juniors and seniors, don't forget to vote for prom court. You can vote for up to five boys and five girls through the DCH, DCHS vote web plug. Voting ends today, so make sure to log on. Congratulations to Kaufman students Reese Bornhauer, Emma Sopko, Ali Padzior, and Brian Ahn for winning the Franklin County Soil and Water Conservation Poster Contest. Are you looking for a fun way to earn service hours? Consider leading a game or activity at Scottish Corners Elementary's Springtacular for Night on Friday, April 21st from 6 to 9 p.m. Everything is organized beforehand. You just show up and help at the event. Sign-up info is posted on the bulletin board outside the guidance office. Buy your friend a rose next week. NHS will be selling roses for $3 each or two for $5. You can send them to your friend, secret admirer, or your significant other. Or you can send a postcard to them instead for 50 cents to show that you care. Roses and postcards will be on sale all next week at lunch. Proceeds benefit Miracle for Madison, a charity to help MLS. Join us on April 13th for the Multiple Cultural Fair. All the cultural clubs are gathering to show the unique aspects of their culture. There will be food, samples, and demonstrations that will not disappoint. It will take place in the courtyard right after school. See you there. Congratulations to the ceramics team, glazed and confused, to, their winning, <laughs> to winning their first competition of the season. Attention all students, there's an Interact Club meeting after school in the staff lounge on Wednesday, April 12th. We'll be finalizing our drive-in movie publicity and logistics. Everyone is welcome. Food, friends, and fun will be provided. Envirothon team will practice tomorrow after school in room A230. Physics club will meet today in room A208 after school to watch End of the Universe from a video called How the Universe Works. All are welcome. The city of Dublin wants to remind student drivers that they are not allowed to park in the city administration building parking lot. There are two lots by the rec center that are available for student parking. Thank you. Crack open those dictionaries. Here's a word of the day. I just want to take my car and I'm going to bring it someplace else. What do you mean? Just, can I have my car? I'm going to pay my bill. I'm, I'm going to be on my way. Well, the car's on a lift. Well, just get it down. All right. OK, well, um, wait here and I'll, uh, I'll bring it around. OK, thank you very much. He's bringing it. Good. Abscond, verb, leave hurriedly and secretly, typically to avoid detection of or arrest for an unlawful action such as theft. Now over to Will of Sports. The boys lacrosse team came back from a 7-4 deficit to beat Jerome 9-8 for the Dublin sweep and sole possession of the Emerald Cup. Evan James, Andrew Boyle, Nick Harris, Matt Dennis, and Ethan Tyke all scored for the Rocks. They are back in action tonight at home against Pickerington Central at 7. Girls lacrosse beat Ursuline Academy on, sat on Saturday 14-9. Delaney Mur Murray and Renee Tonnen led the offense, combining for nine goals. The girls track team finished second and the boys third at the Lexington Invitational. Abby Steiner won both the 100 and 400. Will be Watine won the 300 hurdles. Maid Cameron won the pole vault. And the girls also took home a win in the shuttle hurdles. The boys won the 4 by 1600 meter relay, and Lucas Bonds won the 800. The softball team went 1-1 one one over the weekend, first beating Big Walnut 9-4, and falling to, Van to Danville 3-2. The girls play again tonight at 5:15 at Olin Jedgy Orange. The baseball team plays Marysville tonight at 5, and boys tennis has a match at 4. Both are at home. That's all I've got for sports. Now back to the desk. Thank you, Willsby. Uh, well, uh, I, miss, I miss your beard, Will. you got to bring it back. Yeah, that, that would be nice. The, uh, the old straggler. The old... Uh, pirate that is scurvy beard. All right. Thank you That's for watching. That's all we got.